Hello, I'm Jerry Ford, the beer review guy. We're going to do a revisit of Shinerbach. It's probably been three or four years since I've reviewed one of these. Um, probably since I even had one of these. Um, so this is um, this is a classic. It's been around a long time. Um, every drop of Shiner is brewed in Shiner. Spotzel Brewery, Shiner, Texas. <clears throat> small town, small brewery. Every drop of Shiner beer is brewed right here in Shiner, Texas. Population 2069. By a handful of local craftsmen who take pride in our little brewery and our classic Shiner Bach. First brewed in 1913. This lightly hopped American style Bach has a clean flavor and a slightly sweet finish. We hope you enjoy drinking it as much as we enjoyed making it. Prost. Prost. All right. Let's see. This is a twist off top. Mm. Nice aroma. Okay, got kind of a bronzish, dark, yeah, more bronze, um, kind of brownish appearance on the beer, almost a little, a little under finger of head. Head is kind of a khaki vanilla, a little bit. Um, <coughs> Head is a little frothy. What's there? It just has a nice, um, kind of a darkish, kind of a caramel, malty aroma. Um, <clears throat> maybe dark. You know, kind of like that that Ziegenbach I I had. It kind of reminds me the same with this same characteristics. Uh, a little, you know, the breadiness um, has kind of a balance between the bread crust and the white bread part in the way of a little bitter, a little sweet kind of aroma. A little kind of wheat um, kind of uh, aroma. Well, it's kind of in the way of yeastiness, but it smells good. All right, let's go. Really good flavors. Um, it's got that medium body, light to medium carbonation burn going on. Um, but pretty much the same on the flavors. Getting that that sweet um, <clears throat> uh, mouthfeel right up front. And then you get that kind of a little bit of a, a bitter, uh, lightly bitter um, bread crust kind of taste on the back end subsiding off. Um, Kind of some a uh, um, um, little bit of dark, dark malty kind of taste to it. Um, I don't know if this has adjuncts or hops in it it kind of the lightly hopped American style Bach, Bach so the hops that are in it are just they're not huge lightly is what, what they're saying um, But yeah, it's really good. I like it. It's been a while since I've had one of these, like I said. Very good. 
maybe I'll do a, I still got the Ziegen box left, so maybe I'll do a comparison video between this and the Ziegen box. Would y'all be interested in that? Two box? Let's kind of see what the differences are in between it, the color, the head, the taste. Might do that <clears throat> while I still have both of them. Okay, I'm going to end it here. I thank you all for watching. Um, I'm sure nobody nobody out there hasn't had the opportunity or the chance or has not tried the Shinerbach because it's unless you just don't like Bach type type beers um, but this is the most popular one that I know of it's this one this and maybe Michelob Amber Bach or something Okay, well, I'm getting to it there. I thank you all for watching. I appreciate it. And we will see you all on the next one.